morning, and beautiful people. <laughs> I know I'm looking a little crazy right now, but y'all, I found this wig in my closet and I decided to spruce it up and put it on. I've had this wig for like, I don't know, maybe like three years now. I've worn it a couple times. I never really could figure out how to do the curls right, but your girl figured it out. It's not stiff. And I got the curls popping. Um, I should have recorded all that, but I'm not really a hair person. Um, so I didn't, I just kinda, kinda rolled with it and it turned out pretty decent. But I have a pretty busy day today, so I figured I'd take you guys along. I'm gonna see one of my clients today, um, cause I'm working today. Yesterday I kinda took off where I didn't really do much. I went to a meeting and, babe, what do you want? Why are you looking at me? Oh. You know who I'm talking to. Oh, yeah. Don't do that, trying to act like I'm talking to nobody. You know ain't nobody in here. I'm talking to my, my fam, my YouTube fam. Hey, what do you want? You just want to be on camera, don't you? They got new glasses. He want to show you his glasses. <laughs> hey, anything you want to tell him about your glasses? Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> then what do you want? Why are you in Why you got here? a thing on your head? Because I got a hole that I glued. I glued, I sprayed some little adhesive spray. And I yeah, I'm glad you, uh, Put it down, so it was kind of. Yeah, well, I was just trying it on last I'm night. Saying, get out. I like it like that okay, thank you. Get out. I didn't. I didn't ask for your. Uh, whether you like it or not. <laughs> anyway, like I was saying, I have to go see a client today, and yesterday I kind of took off where I didn't really do much. Um, so today is going to be a busy day. Kind of <laughs> like I'm going to see my client, but it's a bunch of stores out there where she lives. I'm going to be. Um, I don't know if I told you guys already, but I wanna redo this bathroom. It's very, very basic and it's a mess. I just picked up things um, here and there when we first moved in because we didn't plan on staying here long, um, just for the year. We are renting and um, it just seems like the housing market is so crazy that it doesn't make sense to move right now um, or at least buy a house right now. So I think we're gonna stay put another year. So, um, unless, you know, the um, interest rates come down or some of the prices come down or something, which I am starting to see prices drop a little bit, but the interest rates have gone way up. So, I don't know what to do. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Um, there is, I believe there's a Home Goods over there. There's a Ross and a TJ Maxx over there. Maybe a Burlington as well. It's near the airport, so where my client lives. So, you know, there's a bunch out there to look and see um the colors that i kind of want to go with are these colors i don't know if I, I showed you guys this um the million roses uh gift that babe got me so i kind of want to bring out these colors in this bathroom also those colors go with the big picture that i got and never used like it's just sitting there i don't know if you guys can see it. it's like an island themed big picture but i can hang it on the wall i just haven't <laughs> And, you know, like I said, I just didn't see the need to. Um, but I do kind of want to start fixing it up around here because we're going to be here another year, at least. And then the stuff that I buy can take with us to the new house if we decide. But, um, yeah, so let me go ahead and finish my face. Um, Jeremiah is up and getting ready to um, go get his state ID. I was going to say driver's license, but it's just a state ID. So he can, um, what did he need it for? It's just good to have, but it was a specific reason why. Now I can't remember. But anyway, <clears throat> I want to hurry up and drop him off at the barbershop and then have Babe pick him up and take him to the DMV. But where's my stuff? All right, so I'm about to do like a little, not a voiceover, but like a montage, put some music over this and go ahead and do my makeup. I just do simple, it's simple stuff. So, I mean, if you want me to explain or do a, a makeup thing, then let me know. Um, it's so simple, it really doesn't need <laughs> You know all that but let me go ahead and do that
that's the best, that's the best wig I can see. <laughs> oh gosh. I think that is cute. All right, y'all, well, I guess I'm getting ready to head out, go see my client. Let me get my computer and stuff. That would be helpful. <gasps> And um, I don't know, like I said, I'll see you guys when I get where I'm going. All right, y'all. Just wanna let y'all know, I did drop Jeremiah off at the barbershop, because I could not. I could not let him get his picture like that. I should've showed y'all what he looked like. Come on, car, watch where you're going. Um, yeah, I should've showed y'all what he looked like. He literally just got out. But um, hopefully they can get him in before Babe come back to get him um to get his uh id picture taken because you still have to make appointments down here to go to the dmv so his appointments at 11 45 is 10 30 and it takes about a good 30 to 40 minutes to get there so he's probably going to pick him up around 11 um or a little bit earlier so hopefully you know hopefully everything works out because i would hate for him to have to get that picture with his hair like that lord <laughs> y'all could have seen it Anyway, let me pay attention. <laughs> Alright guys, so I just got to my client's house. Let me get some water. It's a little warmer here today. I don't plan on being here long. Um, she doesn't speak much English. She moved over from India. Um like in 2008 <laughs> and she still struggles with her English so I've been helping her with her um you know her citizenship and reading her mail and stuff making sure that she maintains her benefits and stuff um and just making sure that she can you know continue to thrive even with the language barrier so I'm here to read some of her mail oh Go through her mail. Um, she's due to re-sign her lease, so I have to make sure that she did that electronically. Otherwise, we'll go to the rental office and just make sure that she signs it. Um, there's really not much. I've done a lot already. I've been working with her for a couple months now, so you know we've already completed the paperwork for citizenship. We've gone through a bunch of her mail and just made sure that you know she's still getting her food stamps we want to recertify when it's time to recertify um you know making sure that her you know ssdi all her benefits are in good standing um and then you know just find her some additional resources if needed so that's kind of the gist of what i do most of what i do is done from home like i do it on a computer over the phone with the clients or we do like zoom meetings but because of the language barrier i come out to her which I really, um, like, I like this because trying to talk to her on Zoom, which I tried a couple times, or at least once, it was so hard. Like, the struggle was so real. Um, but if there's anything I don't understand that she's trying to tell me, then I will usually pull up either my Google um, Translate, which is helpful, or... Um, sometimes they have like this translation service that you can, you know, call, and they'll translate it for you. Um... So, yeah, utilizing that sometimes. And then just listening. Um, she can point out things that she doesn't understand. Like, she can speak English, um, but it's just to a certain degree. So, yeah, I'm about to go in here. I already turned the car off, so it's getting kind of hot. So, let's go in here. Do what we need to do and get on back home. Because I'm not trying to be here. Babe just texted me. It's 1135. Babe just texted me and said, Jeremiah's still in the barbershop. That is so crazy. And his appointment was at 11.45 at the DMV. First of all, I dropped him off at 10, 10.30. Why is it taking so long? It was today. Tuesday? Tuesday? What's today? Wednesday? Today is Tuesday. Who is in a barbershop on a Tuesday like that? Anyway, that's not my problem. I tried. Let me get in here help her and get on back home all right y'all oh no i'm not going back home i gotta go shopping forgot <laughs> all right y'all bye so they got a home goods and a ross down there mike was over there let's go in here and see what they have is 
nice. I might just get a cart just because. Never know. <laughs> Alright, I gotta stay focused in here because it's easy to get distracted. Ooh. I'm looking for some plants. I like this one. That's uh, $24.99. This is different. Well, let's, let's get what we came for. thinking about decorating that bathroom I really like this color blue I like how deep it is it's not like that dull navy blue which I've been seeing a lot of so I think I'm gonna grab these two rugs these are the only two that's left put these in front of the sink and then see if I can find anything else well, let's go in the other aisle and see if they have anything else that I can use. They also have a clearance um, aisle over here for bathroom stuff. <laughs> so, let's see. Here's the little clearance section. I mean, can you ever have enough baskets? Here's a blue one. What's the clearance price? $16. Some more clearance. Uh, what's this? I don't need a shower curtain or anything. But I do need toothbrush holder. Is that ten dollars? Mm. This is different. Like a soap dish, $5.99. I like that. That's nice too. So a lot of times when you pick blue for a bathroom, you kind of get thrown into like this beachy themed vibe and that's not what I'm looking for. Like even though I have that big picture up there with the beach island theme, I don't want like seashells or you know, crab little stuff like that i just want just regular <laughs> like i want it to be simple but nice if y'all if you get that nothing too over the top just simple but nice let's go back over here and see what they have is this blue i don't know but i like it see this is what i don't want <laughs> Yeah, I don't want that. That's pretty. $12.99. You know, I thought they would have a better selection. Oh, here's some more. Mm, this is pretty. $7.99. Oh, here it is right here. I love this. This. I love this. $9.99. What's 
$6.99. I like this. I think I'm gonna get this stuff. That's pretty. They do have some other blue stuff, but that one is sticking out the most. This is kind of simple. Hmm. Yeah, this is all the blue stuff that I see. So let me grab this while I'm here. I love this. Now I'm not sure if this match. We'll see. All right, you guys, so I got the goods. So I'm getting ready to, I think, I wanna run in this Ross real quick and see what they have. I found the bulk of what I need. I just need two dark, um, two dark towels, the big towels that match the carpet or the rug. And I need another, at least two more rugs, the same exact color to um, put in front of the shower and the toilet. It's hot, it's hot out here. <laughs> Florida life but it's beautiful it's beautiful loving the palm trees for sure now let's get in this Ross oh I forgot to tell y'all that Jeremiah couldn't get his ID because so Jeremiah's name is spelled wrong on his birth certificate and I call myself fixing it and they wouldn't take it <laughs> so his middle name starts with the R and they have it as a K so I just put the little hook on it and they're like no ma'am you cannot do that so it's not my fault he didn't get his ID. So I have to order him a new birth certificate. The, the bad part about it is like I, I did this years ago and nobody ever said anything about it. But I guess now that he needs, you know, definite like documentation to prove who he is, I gotta get it fixed. So anyway, we're at Ross. Let's go in here and see what they have. Oh, I'm hungry. From the looks of the line, I'm probably not gonna get nothing out of here. That line is crazy long. But I'm gonna look, let me see. Well, at least this does have a little bit of that blue in it, like a darker blue. Maybe we could do this. That's pretty much all I'm seeing. And they have the little matching towels too. Hmm. That's pretty much all I see. How much are these? Nice and soft. $6.99. It might be a win. You might get those. Let me see what else they have. Oh, here goes some rugs. But of course, they don't have. This is the same material, but not the right color. Um, okay, nope. I would be so mad if they had those. Um, brush holders and soap dispensers in here <laughs> for cheaper it's gray might have to order it online to find the exact um the exact ones that i have all right let's get these do i want to get these towels do i want to stand in that line i'm just going to grab two Winning! Look at this, y'all. Look at this. Go to the front of the line. <laughs> Yay! Found some stuff though. All right, y'all. So look, Babe called and asked if I could stop at um, PetSmart. Cause y'all know we got that fish tank, and um, he needs some filters 
which I ain't supposed to be getting because I ain't supposed to do nothing with that fish tank. But anyway, there's a Pet Smart over here. I didn't know that there were also Home Goods, Marshalls, Hobby Lobby. So, yay, win win situation. Look, y'all, they got Hobby Lobby, they got Fresh Market, Marshalls, Home Goods, Ross, Haverty's, Forever 21. Yes. Better. I'ma make a better way. 